The American spirit is uh, present in Hamilton because it's really the roots and American spirit for us is really trying new things, daring, you know, in the United States everything is possible and that's really the spirit we try to implement into the brand, being a pioneer and trying new things. The first milestone was 100 years ago, back in the 20s, when Admiral Richard Byrd had a mission for the pole. Hamilton has a very rich history when it comes to partnering with the sky, because it dates back to the 20s, the early 20s, and Hamilton was equipping, for example, airlines like TWA Eastern. World War II was a very important milestone for the Hamilton brand because the brand was mandated by the government to produce watches exclusively for the army. So the armed force were equipped with Hamilton watches, the field armies and of course the pilots. And that was very important because it enabled the brand to really change the manufacturing ray and to enter a new era of production of very, very high quality watches to ensure reliability to the armed force. Ten years ago, we had a great chance to meet with Nikola Ivanov during the Red Bull Air Race and we started uh, to have Nikola as an ambassador. He's one of the top pilots in the world and we discovered this fantastic world of aerobatic flights with Nikola. Meeting with Nikola and meeting with the world of aerobatic flights, we were confronted to G's because when Nikola flies, uh, it takes from 0 to 10 G's and it's a very strong pressure that uh, is applied to his wrist and uh, to his body and that's why with ETA we wanted to dig further and understand the impact of gravity on the chronometric performances of our mechanical watches. After a year of scientific studies at ETA, they really wanted to prove with a real case that gravity had an impact on the chronometric performances. So we contacted Jean-François Clairvoy, who is a famous French astronaut, and immediately uh, he had an interest in putting us in contact with the French aerospatial agency, the CNES. In October 2015, Hamilton and ETA had the chance to be able to fly in Bordeaux with three specific flights enabling us to have 30 minutes of zero G and being able to test our watches with a special equipment developed by ETA. Our special equipment was built around two Vichy machines that enable us to measure the performance of the watches and take several measures in different positions during zero G flights. For Hamilton, the result will be very interesting because it will enable us to improve performances of our watches and we sell a lot of watches to pilots and pilots are people who need precision. So it's very interesting for the professionals but also for daily life. People who can use their watches during extreme sport are submitted to G-forces and by improving the performance of our watches we will also uh, improve the daily use of our watches. I would like to thank the North Space Company and the CNES because it was really interesting for us to discuss the impact of gravity on our watches. They are passionate people about the sky, same as us. So really thank you to the CNES and North Space.